Hi, welcome. Thanks for joining me on this episode of Build Your Own. We're going to do, well, you can see it, this 2018 Roush Jackhammer Fastback, right? Package starts at 14765 That comes with a bunch of stuff on it. After we get through the build, at the end, we can see what everything's installed. So you have to look at the watch till the end to see. Uh, but there are two other uh, 2018 Roush Mustangs. There's a Stage 1 and there's a Stage 2. All right, so I've also done the build for those and all the other Roushes that you can configure uh, on their configurator, and it's all in a playlist. I'm going to put the link up right here, so you can just get over to that playlist. You can watch any and all of those videos, share them, like them, and all that. So let's get into it. All right, the 2018 Roush Jackhammer uh, Mustang Fastback doesn't come in a convertible. Uh, the package is 14765 that doesn't obviously include the price of the vehicle. They say above the price of the vehicle. Obviously, you're going to already have owned. You own the vehicle. You have that. Um, let's just take a look around this thing really quick. It's super attractive. Love this splitter down here. Super aggressive. I like it. All right, so let's get started. All right, each jackhammer has been prepped for a full 710 horsepower supercharger installation with much of the underhood preparatory work completed by Roush at the factory. The balance of the supercharged system may be purchased separately and installed at the dealership after vehicle sale. Choose the option. What is this? So if we want the uh, supercharger, uh, let's see. Uh, if the Mustang has already been sold to the customer, Roush will complete the installation of the entire supercharger system with the vehicle having the full... Okay, gotcha, 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 gotcha. If you if you already have the car, then this is your option right here. If you are uh, having this done, blah 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 blah, uh, then the dealer takes care of it. If you're buying the car brand new and having the Roush package on it, um, so let's just assume that we already have one. Let's just already assume that we have one. I get well. If it's a 2018, let's assume that we've got it brand new. All right. And so next. Uh, choose our option for colors. Choose our options for colors. Uh, we got the silver. No. Blue. Eh, it's okay. Magnetic. The yellow. The ruby red. Oxford white. Some of these, I just got done building the uh, Super Duty version. That's cool. And, and black. And shadow black. And you know, some of these colors were shared over there on that one as well. No surprise, of course. Uh, Orange Fury. I've seen a couple in the orange, and they're kind of cool. What's taking so long? Okay, so there's the orange, and then what's this? The royal crimson. We didn't look at that yet. Let's see. Royal crimson, and then the Kona blue, the red, the shadow black. I'm really feeling the shadow black. The shadow black in this car with the supercharger. It's making 710 horse. You know what I'm saying? I mean, shadow black just seems like it needs to be the right color. All right. So, shadow black it is. Uh, a throwback for Mustangs of yesteryear. Roush quarter window scoops provide Roush stage Mustangs with just the right amount of throwback. Uh, do they? Oh, that's kind of cool. You see that? Yeah, that works. 370. We're in. We're in. Top performance stripe. Well, let's change view so we can... Maybe there we go. Let's change view so we can see. What's this? Kinda cool. They do their stripes pretty cool. I wasn't I ended up getting stripes on the Super Duty. They do their stripes tight. Alright, then you got the mat, and then you got the Sin City. What's this one? Performance Pearl. Red blooded American. Red blooded American sounds good, huh? Five ninety five. We're in it. Boom. A telltale sign of Roush Heritage, optional hockey stick graphics come in a variety of colors to match your exterior paint color. So, matte black. Let me see the a different color so we can see where they are. Okay, they're there. Okay. Oh, but you see that? They got rid of, they got rid of um, the other thing we had going on. Yeah. Hmm. These are cool, but do I like them better than the other ones? No. So let me go back, and I think we did Red-Blooded American. Yeah, I like that. We're not going to do the hockey stick graphic because there's just it'd be too much. Obviously, they got to switch it. 
We're not going to do that one. Uh, this is some accent for that graphic. We're not doing the graphic. Um, let's just double check and make sure there's not an accent for this little piece. I don't think so, but if it is, or if it's not, it's easy enough to go back and change it. Okay, yeah, we had it the way it was. All right, so that's fine. Let's just double check, make sure we still got what we wanted. All right, we do. Okay, uh, boom, boom. Uh, the graphic, yeah, all right. Choose your option, automatic or manual. Well, come on, you know, the reality is, if you watched any of my videos, you know how I feel about this whole thing. It's a huge debate. For me, it's a huge debate for people. You know, the fastest cars in the business are are automatic transmissions. I mean, at the end of the day, whether they call them DCT or whatever, it's an automatic transmission. You don't have to shift it at all unless you want to with the paddles. Porsche, Corvette, you name it. Ferrari, Lamborghini, everybody, everybody. Uh, I know for a Mustang, you know, it's classic. So we're going to go with the, the manual transmission, but there is definitely no shame in optioning in this vehicle in an automatic, just FYI. All right, let's move on. Uh, suspension, yeah. Choose between a standard one-way coilover or a three-way coilover, allowing for adjustment to height, rebound, and compression. Well, you know what we're doing. We're doing the, the, the three-way, right, for 1900 bucks. Let's get into it. Boom. Uh, choose an option. Well, let's spin this around so we can get a better look. Can we get a better look? Yeah. Uh, what's this? Quad. Oh, do we want the tips in black? I don't think so. I don't think. Wow, they don't even show the car. All right. I don't know if we want the tips. In... Do we want them in black for a thousand bucks? Oh, quad, quad black tip performance exhaust system. Okay. Gotcha. That's why it's a thousand forty five. Yeah, we're in it. We'll do that. Let's move on. Uh, active exhaust system now with black exhaust tips not shown allows for these so allows the user to choose the tone of their exhaust via mobile application I think that's a little much I don't think we need to worry about that that's just gimmicky uh, billet pedals yeah we want the pedals manual pedals automatic pedals we're going to go with the uh, the manual ones look at that you got the sandpaper gray kind of stuff on there really cool 245 could, they could have made them a little nicer but there's nothing wrong with them. Um, the seats. They're not going to give us an interior shot. So we can select between standard seating or Recaro sports seating. Let's get the Recaro sports seats. They don't show us an image of that, unfortunately. But they're probably very cool. Um, and I think it's worth it. Here we go. Roush leather seats are available in the stock style or as Recaro style. That's super cool. So you got the Recaro black. You got the Roush... Uh, with black leather with the red stitching and then silver stitching let's do the red stitching because what that's gonna match you know our red-blooded American theme we got going on the outside right uh, what do we have to do so the following feature option standard seating uh, wait a minute wait a minute cancel what's this black Recaro seating Roush leathers ah gotcha or as a Recaro style race seat. All right, got ah, there we go. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. All right, there we go. Seventeen fifty. That's what we're gonna do. Okay. Uh, I was a little confused there. Sometimes that happens. I just needed to do a little bit of reading. Sometimes I try to keep it moving, and sometimes in doing that, I sk skip over stuff, and I need to go back and read, which is what happened there. All right. So six speed shifter ball. Yeah. Do we want that? That classic look. Yeah. That's super cool. I want that for 95 bucks. Even if it was $295 or even more, I'd probably still get it because it's just cool. Uh, Roush trunk mounted tool kit. Yeah, we want that. Why not? You know, I, I want to buy into the whole, the whole uh, ambiance, the whole package deal of having one of these. Up to and including getting everything to say, yep, I even have the tool kit. Right? So... 440, we want it. Uh, locking lug nuts, yeah, we want those. Boom. What else? That's it. That's it. Um, now, I'm not going to submit my information to do the PDF. I'm going to kind of uh, put a PDF together for you so that we can down, so you can download this information. And I'll put a PDF uh, link in the description so you can download all this stuff. So here's the deal. The package was 14000 We put 
$6,500 in options on the car. Uh, transportation costs a thousand bucks. Twenty-two thousand two sixty-four for this. Now here's the base package, right? The car comes prepped for the seven hundred and ten horsepower, where the dealer puts in the rest of the system. If you buy the car new, if you don't buy the car new, you could add another seven thousand dollars to this, basically thirty grand, because they'll put the whole package on the car, including the supercharger. That's why it's a zero cost option right now, because that's what we chose, as if we were buying the car from the dealer. Uh, we went with the ebony, or sorry, Roush ebony black cast aluminum, uh, cast wheels wrapped with ultra high performance continental extreme contact sport tires, extreme duty half shafts, performance one way coilover suspension, right? That's standard. We did the three, uh, the three way JH strut tower brake, uh, brace front arrow corner pockets. Uh, I'm assuming that's probably somewhere right down there. Uh, High flow upper grill with JH badge, uh, jackhammer, right? High flow lower opening, front chin spoiler with wheel shrouds, uh, body side scoop in body color, hood heat extractors, um, hockey stick graphics, Roush fender badges. I'm going to start kind of scrolling a little bit. You could always pause the video if you want to read everything. Uh, illuminated door sill plates, that's super cool. Interior medallion, license plate, hood, uh, jackhammer, serialized engine bay plaque, um, hood strut, lift assist, aero foils. Cool stuff. Cool stuff. All right. So I'm going to make that a PDF for you really, really quick. So that way, if you want this information for whatever reason, uh, it's going to be available for you. Other than that, I really appreciate you watching this. And if you found it helpful, please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Share the video. Like it. Uh, that really, uh, I'd really appreciate it. Thanks a lot.